Now just a quick video with some good news. Um, this pullback, which has been really a pain in the ass the last couple of days, um, well, the last week really, really much more violent and strong than expected, um, has ended. So this bar here, you can see, is the biggest down bar in the whole thing. That is very typical for the end of a counter trend move. Now, it actually gives us a bit more confidence in sustained upside because counter trend moves always have the biggest, uh, the biggest drop right at the end. And this is still an intra bar candle. It's got about 12 hours to go, but this looks like painting a retest of the lows here formation. And we're looking at something like that. So hallelujah, it's over. How do I know that? Um, I haven't got like, you know, 100% confidence in it, but if we drop down to a one hour chart, you can see if this was gonna fall off the plate, it would have fallen off the plate here. Um, it, it, it's probably still gonna fuck around a bit for, another, for a few more hours, I'd say. But what really gives the, uh, the clue here is when we look at Ethereum Bitcoin, Ethereum stopped going down ahead of time, which tells us that we're not going into a bear market. Ethereum is a higher risk asset than, than Bitcoin. If Ethereum goes up first, it's a risk on situation. So this is very, very promising. We've broken, uh, we've got a big hammer candle here. We've broken daily bar highs already. Ethereum looks poised to continue its rally against Bitcoin. Very, very good. Now, let me show you one cool thing. This is all our alts lined up against each other. And you can see that Ethereum's roughly hovering steady with Bitcoin over the last couple of days. It's down 0.23%, but we see quite a lot of alts and uh, um, making a run for it. So quite a, quite a lot of alts um, and, you know, stupid alts like Chili's and Bitcoin Cash and dumbass shit like Litecoin. Fuck you, Litecoin. Um, this is very random, but we're seeing risk on. Near the worst performing alts were only down 4.3% against Bitcoin. If Bitcoin was going to keep falling off the plate, um, alts would be going down much, much harder. So this is the end, buy the dip, um, it's back on, uh, you know, this shitty time, officially over, calling it, okay, that's the 